morning guys it is wednesday morning and i have the day off work today which is super nice um just kind of hanging out at home david had to work today so i am just really like chilling i laid in bed for a while i edited today's video made breakfast and now i'm going to head out to do my last minute errands i need to go to the grocery store and I think I might go get a coffee. Um, I think that might be it. I was gonna go to the post office, but I'm not gonna do that anymore. So I'm gonna head out to the grocery store just to grab a couple things to bring to Christmas. And yeah, um, we're supposed to get a huge snowstorm today, which I'm excited about because we don't have any snow. And Christmas without snow just doesn't seem right to me, especially like growing up in the Midwest my whole life, we've always had snow. So yeah, it just seems weird without snow. So I'm happy that we'll have snow for Christmas, but it's also like the main day of traveling. So I feel like people are struggling to like know if they should like drive home yet or if we wait till tomorrow. So I think David and I are just gonna kind of play it by year and see how it goes <laughs> hopefully it's not too bad um but yeah that's kind of the plan for today i'm getting my hair dyed so i'm probably not going to do my hair today probably will put on makeup but just kind of felt like letting my skin breathe this morning so we're gonna go makeup free to the grocery store and yeah all right i am going through the starbucks drive through i'm not sure if i want a hot coffee or an iced coffee iced sounds better but it's kind of cold out sure okay i went with an iced coffee just sounded better than a hot one today and i just called my hair salon i think i'm actually gonna end up canceling my hair appointment today just because it's not till 4 30 and the snow is supposed to well it's already raining and i think it's supposed to start in like an hour which it's 11 right now and i just feel like the later we get going the bigger chance that we probably won't go tonight so I just feel like you know hair is not that important I can do it another day so I'm thinking we'll cancel it and David actually is getting done with work a little early so I think we'll probably end up getting to leave around 3 today instead of like 8 so my mom will be very happy to hear that and I just feel like it'll be safer for us to do that so that's kind of what I'm thinking. I have to call David just to see if he agrees that that's probably the smartest idea. So, yeah. All right, I got my coffee, and it's actually so good. So, it's just an iced coffee with one pump of hazelnut syrup in it because I don't like it too sweet. And then I added cold foam on top um, just because otherwise I could make, like, a hazelnut coffee at my house, and I just want it to be a little special. I get Starbucks probably, like twice a month so when i go i like to like kind of treat myself and make it you know a little bit more fun than just like the typical black coffee i have at home so yeah this is really good still tastes super coffee like which i enjoy i don't like it when it's like super milky or um something like that so yeah super good and now i am gonna brave target because that is where i usually grocery shop but it looks like a zoo so fully prepared that they probably won't have everything i need for groceries so let's go in and see what what it's like all right change of plans so i canceled my hair appointment for tonight just because the storm has hit and i can hardly see like anything outside my window it's like white out right now so david's getting done with work any minute now it's like 2 15 and we're gonna try to get on the road like as fast as we can just to make sure we're safe um so i've been kind of just running around my house trying to like wrap up everything and get ready so that is what i'm doing i wanted to show you a few things i actually picked up at target when i went and got groceries because of course i had to go through the clothes section and the beauty stuff so i got a few things and i wanted to show you guys all right the first thing i got was this maroon corduroy dress it has these little like puff sleeves and then it goes to like a little bit above the knee i thought this would look really cute with tights for 
Christmas Day maybe or Christmas Eve. Um, I have to try it on because it's not maternity and I just sized up. So sometimes that works and sometimes it doesn't. But I just wanted to grab it because I thought it was really cute. And I walked through the pajama area, which I already have my Christmas pajamas, but I just kind of wanted to buy um, a new set. And their line there, I think it's stars above, yeah, has literally the softest pajamas ever. Um, so I picked up this little set. It's just like a long sleeve and then the bottoms are just like long pants and they're literally the softest things ever. They're also not maternity, maternity, I feel like I'm not saying that right, um, but they're so thin so that even if they're tight on my belly, it doesn't like hurt. Um, so I picked up these, they're just in a really pretty blush color and I love those. And then I saw someone post about these, I think it was Zoella, but she had these pixie like eye patches and I don't ever use these, but I've been wanting some recently, and instead of buying just like a bunch of packets of it, it just comes in this little like container, and I think there's just like a bunch of them, and they're all like in this really nice like gel, so I think I'm going to bring that. Um, tonight, I think it's just going to be... David and I and my parents, uh, my brothers are coming tomorrow. So I thought I would bring like a face mask, these eye patches, and just kind of have like a little um, spa night with my mom. Um, I just thought that would be kind of nice before uh, Christmas that we could just do a little spa night. So I'm gonna bring these and I'm gonna pack away my pajamas because I'm definitely gonna bring those. And hopefully this dress works, if not, I have other options, but my advent calendar is actually sitting right here. This is the second to the last day. I'm gonna bring my box with me to open tomorrow. Tomorrow's the last day on Christmas Eve. Um, but day 23, this is cool. I've actually, not, I don't know if I've ever used a cleansing oil. So I've heard really good things about them. You use them before you like actually cleanse to take off your makeup and stuff. First off, this packaging is super cool. I've never heard of this brand, but it is a cleansing oil that you use on your dry skin when you have makeup on and then you wash it off. And this is a rose hip fruit extract cleansing oil, which I'm very excited to try. That's really cute. She already threw my um, tomorrow's gift in my bag to open. So this box is completely empty now. It's so cute. I feel like I don't want to throw it away, but I don't know what I would use this for. But even like a gift box next year or something would be really cute. So I think I might save this just because it's cute. And yeah, that was so fun. I definitely am going to do that every year. I just think advent calendars like for kids for adults like it's all just something fun to open every day so yeah super thankful that david got that and that was an amazing advent calendar so next year if you are wanting to do one check anthropology but check it early because when i did my gift guide i included that which was in november and it was already sold out so just remember next year if you want the anthropology one to get it early because it was sold out so fast so now i am going to basically what am i gonna do i have to finish it, wrapping one present and then i haven't ate lunch yet it's like two o'clock so I'll probably eat before we leave and yeah we are officially on our way just took us like an hour to pack this car we are like packed to the brim david said before we left like not really sure how we're going to have a child in here eventually because anytime we go anywhere it seems like our car is full so we're either gonna have to become minimalist. more minimal <laughs> or i don't know we're gonna have to strap her to the roof or something but we are on our way ready for christmas are you excited yeah, glad yeah. we got a little snow. I know, it, does, it makes it so much crispier. Driving crispier. now is not ideal, but. Yeah, it probably will take us a long time to get home, but 
we are going to take it easy, get home safely, and I think on our way we're going to pick up takeout from one of our favorite places from our hometown, and I'm pretty pumped about it. We haven't had that in so long. No, we haven't. Yeah. So, we're on our way. Here we go. It is way later now. Um, we ended up getting in a terrible snowstorm to the point where we almost had to pull over and get a hotel and my parents don't live that far away from us that's how bad it was we literally couldn't see the road it took us twice as long as it normally does to get here but we got here safe we just drove like 30 miles an hour David was a champ I could have never done it without him or yeah it just it was kind of scary we definitely should have probably stayed home but we made it and we got here and just kind of hung out ate dinner with my parents and then watched a movie and now we're gonna head to bed so tomorrow is christmas eve and i'm excited to see all my brothers and their little kids it's gonna be so much fun so i will see you guys then and I hope you guys have a good night. Bye.